Well, let's see if this is going to work. I haven't been on this computer for, for a little, little while. So, I'm Pops. You're watching Hillbilly Pop Seasonings. I uh, had to change the name of the YouTube channel for commercial purposes. So, thank you for staying with me. Uh, check out the Facebook page, Hillbilly Pop Seasonings. Uh, throw a like, a follow, a share, especially a, a follow. I'm trying to get a thousand followers for 60 consecutive days so that I can become a part of the, the, the STARS program. They have different uh, uh, criteria for people that are not gaming. So, uh, old fat guy cooking on the stove. Just cooking on the stove this morning. Um, this morning we have gravy. This is a uh, pork sausage gravy, uh, country gravy made with uh, Farmer John's uh, relatively lean pork sausage. Uh, I got biscuits in the oven right out of the can. Um, and I'm gonna be, gonna be doing some eggs up. So, please stay tuned for all the fun that's gonna occur here. Oh boy, howdy. Get a little bit of fire, in the, fire up into that pan. A little bit of oil. We don't want them sticking to the pan. We we'll use the stir and spatula, scrape it off on there. Spread that oil around nice and nice and thin. So um, Whilst I get some eggs going on, I'm probably going to scramble them um, because uh, scrambled eggs go pretty darn good with biscuits and gravy. So I'll be right back. All right, boys and girls, pretty little little thing for you. Um, you see the color of those eggs. I use only farm fresh eggs. Um, basically, brown eggs right out of the chicken. Uh, if you get them right out of the chicken and you don't wash them, you can put them on your counter for, oh, like six weeks or something like that. And they stay good. They have a beautiful, beautiful dark golden color to the yolks. Uh, when I go to scramble them, I add a little bit of milk to make them fluffy. Um, and makes them a wonderful thing. So that's what we're going to do. Using the whiskey in a plastic bowl so it makes more noise. And it's a little hot. It smells a little hot. We'll sort that all there too. Just like that. Throw that in there like that. And then. Start rolling that around. I know there's these guys on the, on the interweb that uh, seem to be able to fold these things and cook them just as they go along. Uh, I'm not that guy. We'll take a little bit of the Himalayan pink salt. A little bit of black pepper, a little more of the black pepper because I like black pepper. And those cool little shakers there, they can be found on teamu.com, uh, I think, or uh, Amazon or something like that. So we stir them around like that. Nice and fluffy, no real juicy spots left over. And those are done. Pull the fire off. We we'll pull the biscuits out. The biscuits are a beautiful dark brown. A beautiful golden brown, sorry. My mistake. 
so we're back and we take that off the fire like that. Let me grab a mystical magical plate. Yeah, everybody loves my, my serving plates. It wouldn't be hillbilly if it wasn't on paper. Just saying. And I don't cut I don't cut my biscuits with a knife. I use a fork. I'm not sure why I do this. But man, it's hot inside there. But just stab it in the side and so it falls apart like that. Um, take a little bit of this egg here. Throw it on top of there. Just like that. So we have eggs on top on top of biscuits, right? We're all getting that, right? We're all getting it. We take the mystical magical spoon. That stuff sure does thicken up nicely. On top of there like that. On top of there like that. And we have hillbilly biscuits and gravy. I'll be posting a picture of this to the Hillbilly Pops Facebook page. Hillbilly Pops Seasoning. So, uh, please stop over there and, and give us a follow. Uh, Hillbilly Foodborn on Facebook, Hillbilly Pop Seasoning on Facebook. Um, it's it's a beautiful thing. Come on out, check us out. There's uh, on the on the Pop Seasoning page. There is a lot more uh, uh, food advertisements, uh, a lot of recipes on there. This is going on there as a video. Thank you all for watching. Thank you all for for subscribing. To my YouTube channel. Uh, thank you all for all the support you've given me through all the years. Um, gonna be making a lot more videos. I'm gonna be home for a while. Um, my lovely wife is gonna go have a bypass surgery uh, in about two weeks. So, uh, well, two and a half weeks. I'll be home with her. She'll be resting. It's, it's an open heart thing, so. She's going to do a lot of resting. I'm going to be doing a lot of a lot of stuff at home. Uh, you'll be seeing quite a bit more of me. So, hope you don't mind that. For God's sake, please eat well.